Hey guys, it's Samira and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a what's in my backpack. I have never done one of these on my channel, so I'm excited to do it for the first time. So first off, my backpack is this black Jansport one. I've had this one since sixth grade and I like it a lot and I'm going to continue to use it throughout high school because I can never really get sick of it because it's black, which is the reason I got it. <laughs> and there's also a lot of pockets, which I really appreciate because it's just really convenient to have them. And then and on the side of my backpack, I have my Hydro Flask, which I also got in sixth grade. So starting off with the first pocket right here, I just have my laptop in it. This is the Yoga Lenovo laptop that I got this year. It's super small, which I love because I don't want a big one to carry around because it gets heavy. And I don't have a case for it. I did use one last year, but this year I don't want to because when I have a case, I tend to put trash and like papers in there and I'm trying to keep this area of my backpack clean at least. You know, other parts might get messy, but Then the big main pocket. This is the one where I have couple of notebooks in. Um, I have these two five star ones. One of them I will use for math and the other I'll use for history because those are both my important classes that I'll need to take notes in. Then I also have some other notebooks that I'll put in my bag if a teacher tells us we need one. Those are kind of like the smaller cheaper ones. And then I have whole bunch of folders so here five folders this year i'm not going to be using any binders so i'm going to have a folder per subject again these two will probably go to like the most important subjects that i have that need folders and then the cheaper kind of flimsier ones will go to any other subjects that i need a folder for i'll definitely be using one of these for like all of my tests and then we have this pocket which I have a lot in here actually, so I might put some of this stuff in the main pocket going forward. First, I have this black pencil pouch, and you can actually put this in a binder. I never have, and this year I'm not even using a binder. So here it is, there's two different pockets on it, and first pocket has post-it notes, my compass, which I need to find my protractor because it's not in here right now, some whiteout, and also a little pencil sharpener. I think this is perfect for like standardized tests when you need to use a regular pencil and in case it breaks or anything, I have this as backup. Also for midterms and finals, we have to use like a regular pencil. And then in the main pocket, I do have all my pencils. I have literally one regular one in case I need it. And then some regular mechanical ones. I don't know why all of them are pink. I just realized that a lot of the stuff in this pencil pouch is pink. Uh, I have these pastel ones and then a couple of these ones. And I also have my favorite mechanical pencils ever. Please buy these. These are the literal best thing ever. They are expensive. I bought a pack of three today. I might return it because I just found out I saw these from last year that are usable. And I think it was originally $8, but there was a discount of so six. I will probably use these throughout the year too. Uh, these are just like the ones that I like the best that I use for tests. And also if someone else, like friend or something, needs a mechanical pencil, I'll probably give them the cheaper ones and I'm not gonna give them my $8 ones. <laughs> Even the front is pink, the white out in the pencil pouch. Also in this pocket, I have this little notebook. I bought this a couple years ago, but I've really only used a couple pages in it. And I don't know what I really use this for yet. Probably stuff that isn't really school related if I'm like writing down ideas for YouTube. I sometimes get really random like, YouTube ideas like in the middle of school. And if I just want to do it or something. And then I have another pencil pouch which is pink and in here I have kind of writing utensils that aren't pencils basically so I have a couple of sharpies a silver one and a black one we're always using black sharpies for different things and usually kids don't have them and the teacher has to pass like literally one around to the entire class and I also have these gel pens I used these last year to take notes in my math notebook. I took algebra 2 last year and there was a lot of notes every day we'd have notes and this just makes things stand out, important things stand out if you don't want to just have everything in pencil. And also I have some highlighters which I also use for note taking and you know highlighting and annotating. These are my favorite ones, they're so cute and they're like clear in the middle so when you're highlighting you can like see the next thing you're highlighting. Kind of gimmicky but they're 
they're cute. This pencil pouch is from Yobi. I got it a while ago, but I think when you buy their school supplies or any of their school back to school items, they give a profit to a charity, I'm pretty sure. I don't remember which one. And then I have last year's planner because my planner for this year hasn't come in yet. Uh, I think it's coming in a couple of days. This one is really big and I didn't love that. So this year I got a smaller one and it was also cheaper. This one's from Target, but this time when I went to Target, I couldn't find a 2021 uh, or a 2022, 2023 one. It was only like 2022 or 2023. And I want one to last me the uh, school year, not the calendar year. I also have another folder. This one's paper. So I don't know if I'll use it, but just in case I need another one. I did have the paper one last year and it got all ripped up. So that's why I didn't buy on specific, like specific new paper ones for this year. And then I did skip this pocket right here. This one, I usually have a keychain or something here, but I think I took it off when my mom washed my backpack. In here, I just keep my phone always. It's a perfect pocket for it that I can just grab it out of. And also my AirPods because sometimes I walk home from school. And I also do have amethyst just for some good energy. Down in this pocket, there's kind of a lot of stuff in here, but there's this little one first, which in here I keep a couple of pencils because I don't want to take out like a whole pencil pouch if I just need to grab one pencil. So I have one of the good ones and then one of the decent ones. I have a couple more in there too. And then in this like pouch thing, there's kind of a lot of stuff. Okay. First, I have this pouch and it basically has anything that like isn't for school like supplies wise. It has like deodorant for before band practice or track, dry shampoo if my hair is super greasy, rubber bands for my braces, some lotion so I don't have ashy legs, a Tide Pen. Tide Pen is my saving grace. This is literally so, so good if I spill something on myself. I don't spill a lot, but when I do, it's usually a big stain. And then I have this little pick if I have something in my braces, Burt's Bees, plain chapstick. And then I also have a few hair ties and bobby pins. Throughout the school year, I'll figure out like what I need. Like I think I should maybe put like some kind of lip gloss or something if I need it. And maybe like a claw clip in my bag. And then I also just have this other little pouch with just like tampons and panty liners. And also my uh, shoulder rest for my violin because it doesn't fit in my violin case, which is so annoying. But in high school and even in our middle school, we basically take our bag everywhere with us. But you can request a little locker, so I might do that. I also have a few different Sharpies in here. They're like little tiny pockets for you to put them in, which is super cute that I just knew I had to use them. Also a little tiny pocket in here. Hand sanitizer. Also my school ID from last year. I also really like these five star notebooks because they're really thick, like the paper's really thick. And when I used my gel pens on it, it didn't bleed through. And there's also a pocket here, which I use put like, um, for math, they put like worksheets in it. And then for history, I can put anything, any like paper documents we get. So yeah, that is essentially what is in my backpack. I love this backpack so much. It has everything I possibly need in it uh, pocket wise. So I can put anything I need in it. And let me know if there's anything that you guys put in your backpack. Packs, that's like something I should put. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!